Service officers, including General Erskine's of Kenya fame, inspect a display of mines at a Royal Engineers demonstration at Tidworth. Mine clearing is an important part of the sapper's work, and the flail tank is only one way of doing it. Another is the giant viper, an explosive-filled hose which can be rocket-projected over a minefield to clear a path wide enough for vehicles. The giant viper has a baby brother which can be used by infantry. Building bridges has been a sapper job for as long as there have been sappers, and so has the destruction of bridges when necessary. The explosive charges have been placed and the sappers take cover. Quick demolition is a matter of skillful placing of charges. Sometimes a gap must be bridged under fire, and that's when a linked arc comes in handy. It consists of two turretless Churchill tanks with trackways above their hulls, which can link themselves together before entering the gap, and then open up to provide a bridge strong enough to carry any existing fighting vehicle. So the Royal Engineers carry out their centuries-old task of helping the army to move, to live, and to fight.